And returning to that breaking news we told you about at the top of the hour, a suspicious package has caused a nightmare situation at LAX. This is a live look as police investigate at Terminal 1. Assignment Desk Editor Mike Rogers following this breaking story from the desk. Mike, what's happening? Pat, I don't think I could have timed this any better as we look at this LAX camera behind me right now. They've just reopened traffic. Let's go back out to that LAX camera and you can see that upper level finally starting to move here uh, from this whole ordeal, this whole nightmare uh. finally coming to an end. These are the first cars that are moving. What they had to do is they had to get TSA agents back in place. They had to get the airline agents back in place. And what I also just learned is that they had people stuck on the planes on the tarmac. They were not letting anybody get off of their plane once they landed here. So oh. now they're getting those people off. These are the first cars uh, as we start to look. But I want to take you to SkyCal here because unfortunately the damage really is done. Uh, we've got backups on Century all the way over to the 405. Sepulveda is a hot mess as well. People trying to get to their Ubers at the LA exit lot, which you see kind of there at the top of the screen. Ooh. So really, really just a mess. We know of uh, at least eight flights that have been delayed as of this, Pat. Some of those flights actually being held at their origin points. Uh, I just tried to call LAX to get an update. Their phones are turned off now, so we'll have to try again a little bit later on that. But the good news is the code for the bag was not deemed dangerous at all. But as we come back out here to the desk, wow. really, you're looking at the backup here, Pat. Unfortunately, the damage is just kind of already done, and it's going to take a while to clear this out. Pat. You know, yeah, it's busy anyway, yeah. especially on a Friday night. But to have this happen, and you, you have a feeling that there are more people that are in some precarious situations. Yeah, well, and you you just can't get the whole number because nobody's picking up the phone. <laughs> exactly. And there were people that were stuck. Basically, they got off their planes and then they don't allow them to walk past Terminal 1 right. to get to their Ubers or Lyfts. So then you have a large congregation of people just standing there. LAXPD dealing with all kinds of road rage fights, fights in the streets because tempers are boiling, which is just obviously, mm. you know, not anybody should be doing that. But... So just a lot okay, of a, a, lot, a big mess. Okay, well, uh, you're waiting on a loved one. Make sure you uh, try to give them a call, find out what's going. Maybe a while. All right, thank you, Mike.